Or it's a cab. Oh, it's a cabbie. <laughs> oh, on. Welcome back to the channel, and if you're new here, I hope to earn your subscription today. We don't know, sounds pretty rough out there. So I feel like I've gotten these shots like a hundred times and that's because I think I have. <laughs> the last few times we were here, we've gotten skunked. But I guess if you're seeing this, we caught something and we'll see what it is soon, I guess. Katie was just telling me because of the amount of shots that we've actually taken, it feels a little like Groundhog's Day, right? Just yeah. repeating the same thing over and over again. Yeah? Yep. <laughs> we come out here at least once a week. About once a week, try to catch fish. That's what a lot of people don't understand is we show you all the fish and we show you all the catching because we don't want to have you sit there and get bored while we're trying to catch the fish. And a lot of times we don't. But that's okay. It makes catching those fish that much better. Almost there. I don't know how I feel about it, man. Day 438. We have yet to spot a fish. <laughs> right? Yep. <laughs> but the big one this time, right? Yeah. <laughs> the elusive. Well, the elusive. Yeah, the one that got away that we haven't caught first time yet. <laughs> you gotta catch one to have the one that got away. Yeah. <laughs> or almost catch one. Oh, what about the Nux? We always make sure to bring a pair of binoculars just in case we want to do a little whale watching or seal watching or whatever's around. Okay. Or maybe even want stranded people on a boat. Yeah, stranded people on a boat. Why not? Those cars pull them in. Yeah. So I have a buddy that's always interested in uh, fishing from shore or fishing swim baits but doesn't really know how so break down my setup here real quick for you skip ahead to this time if you don't want to see it so pretty much I'm uh, I have a bait caster here it has 30 pound test that goes down to a snap swivel from there it's about two two and a half feet of uh, 25 pound test we have a little egg sinker on there with a with a bead from there I've got this uh, worm hook and I have the swim bait I thought I'd give you guys a close-up shot of what we have here so there's the worm hook and I'm gonna put that swim bait on I think this is a 2 watt worm hook it's nothing large nothing huge because we're using smaller swim baits today um, I think I'm gonna try first this guy it's the same one I had on there the other guy was a little deformed so we're going to switch it up so to put these on the hook what we're going to do we're going to take the hook and the swim bait we're going to put this right in the center there poke it out the bottom bring that up give it a little twist here and it should pop out just like that a little 90 right there 
from there, we're gonna measure where we put the hook in. And right here, all the way through the body, up out the top. And there we go. So when that pops over the rocks, the rocks won't, you know, won't get caught. But when a fish bites down on it, that hook will expose itself. And that's how we hook up on the fish and not the rocks. All right, first cast. Don't have much battery, so might be changing it up in a minute. A bumblebee just hit the tip of my rod, love. I felt it thump. And I looked down and there's a bumblebee. <laughs> Oh, fish on! What? This one might not be legal. Or it's a cab. Smaller, but she's laying. Twenty. Twenty on the dot. Yeah. Ring two. <laughs> she's going back. Or he's going back. Yeah. Alright, so it's a new day, new spot. Didn't have too much luck at the last spot, but uh hoping to change that luck right now. Today the waves are really good. I think the wave power is at like 150 something. So it's pretty calm. We're gonna try to throw a crippled herring out, a synthetic crippled herring. Uh, I read on the package it mimics a dying bait fish. Uh, no doubt I'll lose it pretty quick, but we're gonna give it a whirl. I'm gonna throw the drone up and let you guys see where we are. The beautifulness of today, the ocean is absolutely gorgeous. And Oh yeah, that looks beautiful. Water clarity's perfect. <sighs> and it's not too rough. Let's go. Ooh, these rocks are pretty slippery, so be careful. All right, you might not be able to see this, but it's uh, red and green. I think it's five inch uh, curl tail grub going out, one ounce sinker. Okay, we are switching it up. We're gonna try this uh, crippled herring jig. See how she goes. All right, there it is. Let's try it out. The ocean's not too rough right here, believe it or not. And it's a pretty sunny day. Let's give it a shot. So after a while of trying this jig, uh, didn't happen to catch any rockfish, so we switched it up to a swim bait again. Fish on over here, Katie's got one. Oh, got, oh, got up? Yeah. Good bites, oh. Well, that was exciting. You gotta be real careful on these rocks, man. They get pretty slippery. Plus, I probably shouldn't have left my pole just laying there, but. Unless I hook up on a huge link cod or something, I think it'd be all right. All right, good example of weedless right there. I left that rod and that bait just sitting down there, washing around in the waves, and I still got it. There it is. Going?
You definitely got one. I see him. Perch. Greenling. Oh, what? Greenling. I think it's a male. It's a good size. Yeah. And, oh, you hooked him pretty good. Yeah. So. That was a good hook, but a nice clean hook. Won't, won't be too hard to get him off. No. There you go. Thanks. Yeah. So. Oh, flawless release. And back down he goes. Good, Good job, up. baby. <laughs> oh, I'm on. Oh, it got off. It was a big wing cod. I totally saw what it was. Damn it. Should have set the hook better. Got one? <laughs> oh. There we go. I don't know, bring it up. Did you get off? No. Oh, it's a cabbie. <laughs> Good job, love. That's a big one. Probably keep her. You know what I did with I got it, you're good. I rolled my weight in and then I threw it right here. Yeah, on the edge? Yep. Yep. Right back. Close. Close. Got him pretty good hook too. Yep. Oh, he's got another hook in there. Oh, someone lost him. 